Hello, I am Dr. Sanjay Panikar. I founded Amrita Homeopathy in 1997. We are placed in two locations, Koramangala and Marathali. We specialize in hair and skin problems, respiratory problems, pediatrics, allergies and infertility. This is a very common condition where there is reflux of the food contents from the abdomen to the esophagus. This is otherwise called as reflux esophagitis or gastroesophageal reflux disease GERD. So here what happens is that the abdominal muscles gradually over a period of time becomes a little lax as the age increases or even otherwise when you are a bit obese. The fat content in the abdomen is high and there is a lot of pressure on the stomach and on the diaphragm and so there can be a slight herniation of the stomach into the thoracic cavity and so in the process the valve which is there around the stomach which holds the contents of the stomach in place can get a little loose and so when the patient after having a heavy meal lies down at night to sleep the contents of the stomach will leak into the esophagus and that causes a reflux. So after food or after drinks, if the food or water is leaking into the esophagus or food pipe, the acid goes along with it. And since the esophagus does not have that much protection like the stomach against the acid, the patient experiences burning sensation in the food pipe from the throat to the chest or in the upper part of the chest or in the epigastrium, that is the upper part of the stomach. So these symptoms are often noticed in patients with GERD. So here the treatment of the root cause that is to strengthen the muscles of the diaphragm which goes around the stomach and around the esophagus so that it can constrict and hold the food in the stomach. Like for example when you breathe in the stomach diaphragm moves down so it gives a constriction at the food pipe. So Yoga is again very useful in holding this. When you do this exercise of deep breathing, it constricts and strengthens these muscles. Likewise, there are good homeopathic medicines also which can improve the uh, condition. Like for example, Robinia is a good medicine, Natrumfos is a good medicine, Arsenica Malbum is good, Naxvomica is excellent. There are certain indications like Naxomica you see that the posterior part of the tongue is coated yellow, lack of sleep, excessive fatigue and he is continuously working night, day and he has an ineffectual urge that he vomits and he feels still something more is there, that kind of a feeling and suppose he has other symptoms like the whole part of the tongue, whole tongue is coated yellow, golden yellow, the natrum foss could be the remedy. So likewise, based on the symptoms, we prescribe the remedies and it helps to strengthen these muscles.